Jane presented by Lee Kossel and Feigley Attorneys at Law. And let's get you right to Jane King live at the NASDAQ in New York City. Federal Reserve offers a peek at its 2024 playbook today, Jane. Uh, that's right, Scott and Hannah. So they wrap up that two-day meeting today. No cut in interest rates is expected. We've seen inflation tick a little bit higher this year, so they don't have quite the wiggle room that they did a few months ago. That does mean current credit card, car loan rates will likely not change. Now, the Federal Reserve will also share thoughts on the economy and inflation when they announce that decision around 2 o'clock this afternoon. Well, food inflation is real, and it's affecting everyone. Analysis by Payments Intelligence found 6.5% of the U.S. population reported using buy now pay later apps to buy groceries last year. Only 5% were low income Americans. The rest were those with yearly incomes of at least $100,000. And the head of the FAA said Boeing must improve safety, culture, and address quality issues before the agency will allow the plane maker to boost 737 MAX production. Reuters reports the agency has not begun discussions yet about hiking production. Just this week, a Boeing 737 windshield cracked upon landing at Portland, Oregon's airport. And Amazon's first spring sale starts today. Some deals are live already and include electronics, outdoor furniture, and summer clothing. You do not have to be a Prime member to take advantage of most of the deals. And stocks were higher ahead of the Fed decision on interest rates. In fact, the S&P 500 closed at a record high yesterday. Now, today we're pointing lower and we're pretty quiet. Live from the NASDAQ market side, I'm Jane King. Back to you. Something new on the menu? So uh, how do you feel about Chick-fil-A pizza? Hmm. Chick-fil-A's test kitchen is rolling out a variety of pizza flavors to test, including some topped with a fan favorite sauce and chicken nuggets. Uh, there's also a cheese pizza with chicken nuggets, pickles, and Chick-fil-A sauce, and then a variation with buffalo and ranch sauce, and then a traditional pizza with pepperoni and mushrooms. No word on if or when any of these food items will be offered at Chick-fil-A nationwide. I really do love their chicken, but sometimes you kind of got to stay in your lane. I don't know about if I'm going to Chick-fil-A, I'm just not going to get pizza. That's fair. Right. <laughs> so, I know. I don't. I, they're so good at the sandwich. Mm -hmm. They like really, just, they know. really are. You know, and I yeah. bet, I bet the pizza will taste good. So we'll see. Jane, thank you.